Oh, oh, sorry. Oh, shit. What's going on, Biker Fam? We are headed to Doughboy Donuts. It's the last day to open. Nine years, man. I remember they were over there from Camp Bowie. And I had the donuts for the first time. I was like, oh my gosh. Super thick, fluffy, very dense donuts. Nine years, and the owner's like, hey, look, I gotta prioritize my health, in which I respect. You know, with him having the type of business he has, and me having like YouTube, I can have content. I can step away from shooting content, you know, edit up a couple videos, three or four videos, and take a few weeks off. And he's like, hey, I'm gonna take these weeks off. Uh, all the content I have in the release, which you guys know, and then step away and decompress and do other life things. Because YouTube can be time consuming, especially if you got two channels. I got this one, I got my Black Universe. And, uh, and that can be very time consuming. You know what I'm saying? Cause I enjoy both. I enjoy talking about products from black-owned companies, small businesses that have a great product. They just really need someone to boost it and really thoroughly test it. You know, that's why I pay for all this stuff. And I'm being transparent because I don't want you guys to ever come on my channel and think I'm a fraud or I'm trying to hide who I am. Nah, I'm, this is who I am. I had my black universe way before I began to like life. I got the bikes because I wanted to do something that was cool, that I thought was cool, you know, instead of being the plain nerd that I, <laughs> is the, you know, the dad that's a nerd. Hey, I build computers, well, you know, there's a ton of people that build computers. Even though there's a ton of people that ride bikes, there's a different inherent danger with a bike than there is with a computer. This damn big body on my ass. Act like he don't realize I'm in front of him. That's why I need. To, I have to develop a design. SC2 has failed us. Yeah, that bastard right there. Yeah, like I said, SC2 failed us as far as safety equipment. Yeah, nah, that's, that's not gonna work, so. I still haven't got mine. I might turn it down, I might design something that works fundamentally different. Let's see what I can, have to, I can do, because I'm pretty sure there are trademarks and copyrights I gotta worry about. And I don't wanna build something super dope, put it on the scene, and then they say, oh, infringement, and then they come back and take my shit. <laughs> and put it out a year later. <laughs> I refuse to do that. I refuse to go in there half cocked on anything. So, just know I got some tech in. I'm gonna put my kids on it. I'm gonna make them my designers. Why not? We're gonna bring you guys some cool ass shit over the next, over the coming years. I'm alive. All the years that I'm alive, my plans are to bring you guys some really cool shit. Fort Worth had the Juneteenth flag up for Juneteenth. Shout out to Funky Town Fort Worth.
gonna drop me some gas, but they close at 12. So we're gonna go straight there. Oh, target fixation. I should have leaned. <laughs> oh, shit. I didn't think about that. Oh, I, we gotta look at this. <laughs> oh, fuck. Time for new exhaust. A new bottom bearings. Uh. Okay, nah. That'll pop back. That'll pop back in. Yeah. Okay. Cool. <laughs> yeah. That'll that'll pop back in. <laughs> I wouldn't think like that. That's the <laughs> I think my own damn truck. You gotta see I didn't panic as far as the when I um had target fixation. I didn't try to panic brake and lean. I realized what I was doing, gather my senses. Chose the best course of action initially. And <laughs> I didn't, I'm glad I didn't.
what's up, man? would have been dead. But we know the more. The bit of target fixation. I'm looking at the angle, but I'm also too focused on 
Oh, that Honda. I forgot what that Honda was called. It the Honda Fit. Now, for those who might critique, like, my speed, like, yo, those cats that'll go 30, 40, 50 miles faster than you. I'm going as fast as my reflexes will allow me, right? Like my thought processes, the, the acceleration, the thrill of the acceleration, the open wind on my arms and stuff like that, but also being conscious of that once I was moving, it's a wrap. At best, you know, we just say, that, oh, that's not the best thing, well, being skipped up, needing skin grafts and all kind of stuff. I don't know. Then, you know, broken bones and everything like that. Being a paraplegic. That might be the best scenario. You know, I think it'd be a cruel torture to still be alive, but can't do nothing. Like I can't get a prosthetics, I can't get, I can't use my hands, so I can use hand controls for a motorcycle. I'm just a vegetable for the most part, well physically. But I got all my memories of owning a bike, having a bike. Uh, I'd rather be about it here. <laughs> I hold my kids, play my kids. Yeah. Don't let me go at that point. So we're gonna move over the last minute. We're pretty much here, guys. Pre release the next phase. Yep. I said, I don't know why they're having to close other than he said his health. I would love to get an interview with him. Just chop it over to him as the, you know, this nine years, what it meant. Some of the things we didn't see as customers that he and his team had to figure out real quickly. So, I'm right, gonna go ahead and get our grandma. Get it. What it is, what it is, it is. The last old boy going on our last day. And they were out of the hospital, they had a watch and make The last one, guys. They don't make me like this again. We're leaving. They're still open. I guess they're gonna stay open today. Sell out everything. 
as much as they can within reason, you know. <clears throat> Spoke with the owner's mom, and she kind of let me know like the excitement and the joy that her son had when creating this, you know, brainstorming. You know, going through the, the the process of making that dough. Like you'll never find another. Like I said, just just told you guys, you're not gonna find another donut like that. And <clears throat> ooh, probably should wait a minute. <laughs> I let I let uh, food on my belly. Well, I didn't do. I didn't go so ham this time. I'm gonna take the other way around. I'm very unfortunate. But you know it is what it is. And uh, Melvin always seemed like a cool dude. Good dude. You know what I'm saying? He's dad himself. I understand wanting to build something that you could possibly, you know, that may not be the thought process. I would love to interview him. I would love to interview him and find out, you know, just certain things. Just chop it up with him. And let him just, just get it off. Let's, let's get it all off his chest. You know, some of the frustrations. Some of the the triumphs, the good and the bad, the ugly. However, you know, until the time comes, Doughboy Donuts, I appreciate you for the time we had you, man. To the Doughboy Donut family, I bid you guys speed. To your next endeavors. Peace.